case. Well, it's a silent but deadly killer and could be in 25 to 50 percent of Colorado homes. It's called radon. Fox 21's Tori Kay now spoke with the El Paso County Health Department and gets the latest on radon in our area. Tori. Craig, radon is a radioactive gas that forms right here in our own backyard. If left unnoticed, this stuff could be lethal, but a simple test could change everything. Radon is invisible, odorless, and tasteless. Really, it could be anywhere. Radon is naturally occurring or can be naturally occurring in, in the ground, and it seeps up and can seep into your home, and it's radioactive, and it can cause lung cancer. Right behind smoking, it's the second leading cause of lung cancer in the nation, causing nearly 21,000 deaths a year. We want to get the word out, make sure people test, and if you do have radon, uh, there, let's go through the process and try to get that mitigated in your home. And unfortunately, Unfortunately, it's pretty common in this area. Studies show that 46% of homes that were tested tested high. We are designated zone one high potential radon in El Paso County, much of Colorado, and it's due to our natural rock features where we get the decaying of uh, of uranium to radon. So what can you do? You start by being proactive and getting a radon test kit like this because any household could be at risk. You can have one home that has little to no radon, one that has moderate to high radon right next door. So it's important to test. Even if your neighbor doesn't have it or does have it, it's important for you to test as well. Right now, El Paso County Public Health is giving out free radon test kits. If you do find radon in your home, they have experts that can help you. So go to fox21news.com for the full information. Craig, back to you.